The shofar is a musical instrument made from the horn of a ram. It has its origins in the temple in ancient Jerusalem, where it was one of the many instruments that performed the ritual music that accompanied services. After the destruction of the temple in the year 70, all instrumental music was banned from Jewish prayer in mourning for the great loss the Jews had undergone. All instruments were forbidden, except for the shofar. In the post-temple period, the shofar is traditionally blown only at certain points during the year. In some communities, the shofar is blown throughout the Jewish month of Elul, building up to the ten days of repentance. The shofar is climactically sounded as part of the services for Rosh Hashanah, the New Year festival, and then again at the conclusion of Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement. The cry of the shofar is said to imitate the wailing of a penitent heart calling down mercy from above. The sounding of the shofar is one of the most striking elements in the New Year service. Its unique and piercing sound acts as an unequivocal call to the spirits of the congregation to engage with the holiness of the day. The shofar is one of the last vestiges of ancient temple ritual in contemporary Jewish prayer, and you can plainly hear its antiquity in the wildness and visceral intensity of its tone. It speaks to the root of all religious feeling in the animal and uncontrollable realm of deep emotion.